What up, guys? How you doing? I know, one, I'm in white, which is never a thing, but I decided, well, I don't care. I'm cool. Uh, with the 20th anniversary of Friends has recently come up on Monday, and I want to take you through my trip because I went to Central Perk. In the village, uh, a coffee shop decided to do um, a pop-up Central Perk. And I went, and I had so much fun, and I, I needed to go. I'm obsessed with the show. The show has was something that I could go to. Like many of my obsessive fan, fandom things, um, Friends was something that I could relate to on... If I was having a horrible, horrible day, and nothing went right, I could just flick on, Chandler would make me laugh, and life would be good. So... I went there and I want to show you a couple of things that I got. I got my first cup of coffee at Lafayette and Spring Street. And I hate coffee. It, it's confirmed. I'm not a coffee drinker. But it was free, first of which. And I wanted to try it. And it was cool. And I had so much fun. It was... It was... I waited in line an hour and a half. I know it's crazy. However... I had to. I had to. I had to go to Central Park. It was. It, it had to be something I had to do before I died. So, here's a couple of things that I got. A little little things, but it's all right. This came on the free coffee. It says eight o'clock. That's the company that was there, and it says Central Park. Oh my God! This is Central Park. And then I got a little keychain. Cause why the fuck not? And then I got a bracelet that was really needed. It says you're my lobster. I could not not get this thing. It was so cool. I went with Jenna, my band bitch. The only other person that would understand my obsession and need to go would be Jenna. That's why I went with her. And it it really was amazing. I mean, the, their their merch was sold out a lot, but that's why I only got the bracelet and the keychain. But I, I don't need much to make me happy. I wanted to get a mug, but that wasn't the case. But the fact that I got this was really cool. I'm going to put on my keys today. Um, I really was so happy with it. I mean, I got the chance to sit on the couch. And I have pictures that will be in the, the end of the video. That you guys will get to laugh at my face. Um, but I cried. I legitimately cried, and it was hysterical. Um, I got interviewed by an online magazine that's on MySpace, which apparently is still a thing. Did not know that it's still a, still a thing. And I sung the theme song, and it was awesome. I just... I really... It was one of my lifelong dreams come true to sit down on, at Central Park and sit on that couch and... I felt like a little piece of Americana iconic thing happening. Like, it was the coolest experience I had ever had. I didn't film it because, um, one, I didn't have enough battery life. <laughs> and two, uh, I was just really too emotional to really think about anything because I just took pictures and crying and have coffee in my hands and crying and it was just really bad. Uh, and the, the, the thing that was really interesting that they had security. Not only did they have, like, normal people with said Central Perk, and on the back of the shirt, it's, uh, no, it said Central Perk, 20th Anniversary of Friends, hashtag 20th Anniversary, and, uh, on the back it says How You Brew, and, which, that was the cutest thing ever. But they also had, like, G-Men, with G-Men security, like, fucking, like, wired in, uh, intercom systems and suits and stuff, and they were just... They were intimidating. I looked at them like, I'm not gonna do nothing wrong. <laughs> but it was it was really. I I was I tried to hold back my emotions because I didn't know if they were gonna be like, you need to go, crazy lady. But I couldn't help it. I cried and I just I cried and I was happy and it was a great experience to have with one of my closest girlfriends who is awesome sauce. And okay, I'm gonna go. I'm going to go get ready for a deaf dinner tonight. I'm going to attempt to paint these nails, which I highly doubt is going to be good, but we can try. Okay, love you guys to death. Bye!